following demonstration, we'll take a look at how we can use the spreadsheet to simplify adding and removing multiple load case uh, combinations. So we'll begin by creating a few load case combinations using the load case combined dialog. All right, now that we've created a few, we can see uh, those reflected in the results here. Now, if we want to add several more load case combinations using the spreadsheet, what we can do is first export the load case combinations to a spreadsheet, and then edit the spreadsheet in Excel. So here we can add a few load case combinations. We'll call them C4, 5, and 6. And we'd like to combine the temperature and the G load with different scale factors. And we'll put in a couple of different scale factors here for temperature and G load. We'll go ahead and save it. And then we can import that CSV into our load case combined dialog. And you can see that it uh, has uh, import success. And as soon as we hit the OK, we've got those load case combinations available for us to post process. All right, now in the same fashion, if we have several load case combinations that we'd like to delete, uh, we could right click on each one individually in the load case combined dialog and delete them, or we could use Excel in order to select multiple rows to delete at one time. Then we can save that and import that into our load case combined dialog and we'll have removed those load case combinations. And you can see that immediately reflected in the results. And that concludes the demonstration.